it's a roller coaster ride uh, being involved with Bristol Rugby and I've got to pay tribute to Chris who's uh, been at this for a very long time and yeah, the, the faith that he's put in uh, to me, my management team and the players has been exceptional and yeah, when you see the support that we had today, uh, the atmosphere, the drama, the theatre that's created at Ashton Gate, yeah, it's uh, just the start and you know, we're looking forward to uh, getting back in the Premiership but you know, what we did as a, as a team was all for Chris and uh, the senior management and the, and the supporters because uh, what they've done over the last uh, 10 years has been exceptional. The key is the support here. You know, that is what makes this rugby club. 16,000 people here. Um, you know, we've been averaging seven, 8,000 all the way through our lean years in this championship, which is better than some of the premiership sites. Um, so, you know, that's what certainly has driven me on in the dark days, is when you see those supporters out there. So 16,000 tonight, sold out eight days ago. You know, this place will be rocking when we get those local derbies against uh, our friends down the road and, uh, and uh, Gloucester and Exeter. You know, I can't wait to see 27,500 people in this ground. We knew we had to build a score. We couldn't come here and, and sit on a 15-point lead. Uh, the fours were outstanding. They worked, worked so hard. And they got us in the positions to be able to kick the penalties. So, you know, it's, it's, they, worked, they worked hard for the penalties and, and I was fortunate enough to be able to, to kick them over. It's really exciting, but we know we, we go back Back to day one, now in the pre-season we work hard and uh, start fresh. You can have a holiday first though? Uh, yeah, I'll relax, I'll enjoy, it. enjoy the next few days and then uh, back to work then end of June.